that is due to the blaster. And in this format, everybody's going to own checklist um, cards and names of characters. So somebody's going to own Mothman right away. And uh, the coin gets random between everybody at the end of the break. So even the coin is collected and that that'll get random. So this is actually one of the best hits to get out of this thing. So this is a pretty good one. Not bad to own the Mothman. But there are some really rare ones in here to get too. And um, so we'll see if we can hit one of the rare ones. And so let's go ahead and start up this random. Boom, boom, boom. This is 103. I thought this was 104. Is it 103? Really? Let me double check that. I don't want to make a mistake. Okay, yeah, this is right. Yeah. I went ahead and listed 104 because there is another one of these available. Right there. Anyway, back to what we're doing here in um, 103. Bing, bang, boom. Somebody's going to hit something nice. Let's see what we can find. Start off with the owner name random. Seven times. This should be seven. <laughs> oh, gosh. It's kind of hard to copy and paste it and and make sure it's seven so it could be six maybe that's the seventh one let me double check make sure i got everything right Okay, yeah, so the magic number is 154. That's right, it's 154 owner names and 154 names on the checklist. So it's quite a big random. We're going to be randoming 154 names. It looks like, you know, a lot of spots in this thing, but it's, it's not... It's a total of seven, I mean, 22 just total spots, just multiply by seven to match the checklist. So anyway, back to the random. Seven times through for the owner names. All right, lucky number seven. So the first random is finished. Dan Kay's at the top of there. And Rollo is down there in the bottom of the list. So we got our first random going on finished. Let's get the next random underway. The checklist names. So these have some really wild names on, on here. Seven times through. Let's see if that number matches 154. Ooh, 
lucky. Number seven. All right, so invisibility is up here at the top. And let's now we got the complete random here of all the different cards you can pull, all the different characters you can pull out of this product. And now everybody's going to have ownership of different ones as we paste in the random of that one. So if we put a card with invisibility, you got it, Dan. If we pull a card with Lizard Man of Scape or Swamp, <laughs> that's KCDC's. If we pull a Lake Worth monster, that's for Craig. So this is fun. This is a fun break. Uh, this, some of these can be so valuable. So uh, one of the ones that uh, really kind of curious about is Mothman. But I want to go down the list and make sure that you can just see what you have. And just, you know, we are recording. So just kind of adds to the legitimacy of what we're doing here. That everything is... You know, everybody's got their ownerships over these different ones. And so let's get to it. Let's see what's happening. And what do we got coming out in MetaZoo? Blister Pack Rip. Ho! So I can't, I can't put, paste the whole list up here. But you'll be able to see me cycling through and awarding each card from the break. So this is the blister. Blister pack. MetaZoo. <laughs> yeah they're actually supposed to be real places in the united states and in north america so you could google it and it's a real place it's kind of a it's it's called a cryptid nation cryptid nation is uh cryptid nation cryptid is a uh, fictitious character or a character of lore and so that's what these cards are based on, like the Headless Horseman, the Boogeyman, just, just like these different characters that are kind of folklore characters, like the Mothman, you know, the creature, you know, these different ones. So uh, the first one I really like to determine ownership of right now is the Mothman. Who's, who owns the Mothman? So who's getting this? These are the best to get when they have the hollow. And this is called a full hollow. They're worth more money. So this one is a Mothman. Let's look up Mothman real quick. And you'll be able to see who's got Mothman. It is Robert S. who hits the Mothman. So congratulations, Robert. This one is for you. You've got Mothman on the checklist. Boom. All right. Full hollow. Nice. I do want to get the zoom out uh, working a little bit here is um, that's one thing I want to do on this break is kind of be able to zoom in closer to these. Because if we have all four designs in the hollow, then it's worth more money too. And uh, now on this one, I don't see any of the designs like spider webs, skulls, bats. I don't see any of the the designs. So there's certain things to look for in these. So 
So I definitely got that going on with the with the focus there, the zooming in. I think I'll bring it out just a little bit. But yeah, it's good stuff. All right, so Mothman for Robert S. Congratulations. It's not one of the all-star hollows that we're looking for. Let me grab the special scissors for the break. Bing, bang, boom. Right, it's actually got a place to tear it, but I think we'll, we'll be better off using the scissors. Good luck, everybody, in MetaZoo. Next up is Bunny Man. <laughs> it's Bunny Man. So let's find out who is going to have Bunny Man. Hey, Dave. Yeah, there's some different designs. If you if you um, have all four designs in there, then it becomes called an all-star hollow. Instead of it being a full hollow, uh, it's, it's a one-up on that. So the All-Star Hollows have four different designs. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to show you some of those designs. Bunny is owned by Craig. This is Craig's hit. So we should have another hollow coming up with some of those designs. That had none. Craig, congratulations. This one's yours. But yeah, these have a lot of value to them. Some of these are very valuable. Killer Clown. Rollo. Nice killer clown card. Necromancy. Necromancy. Let's see here. Craig F. there try to highlight that next up is frozen people robert s Kentucky Hellhound. <laughs> Sick him. <'em. laughs> 
<laughs> he has a sick of... See, these are like battle cards. We got football cards like these too now. Where some of these can be really rare. And they're football battle cards, you know, just like this stuff. These just came out. They're new. They're... And uh, we'll show this off in a minute where, you know, if you get a Peyton Manning, it's like he's a beast card to have. Or Tom Brady or something. That's a beast card to pull. He's like going to beat every other card, you know. All right, here's Hellhound. And that's for Craig. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's Kentucky Hellhound. So it's a, it's a um, product called uh, NFL Fifty by Panini, and they're they're football battle cards, and they have some rare parallels and stuff. And you can hit Drowning Sorrows. I think I spelled something wrong. <laughs> can't find it drowning sorrows I'm just gonna put in sorrows oh it's not it's not drowning sorrows so let me his name is that's why I couldn't find it Suwank is his name I spelled that wrong S O U Is that a Q? Might be a Q. Yes, it is a Q. So it's Squonk. That's this character's name is Squonk. Craig, this one's yours, my bro. And next up is Proton Beam. For a Craig, nice one, Craig. May as well highlight the Mothman since we know Robert hit that earlier and highlighting him. Oh, okay. Now we've come to a full hollow here. Full hollow. Lightning glass. Ho. This this is a nice one to get. Lightning glass. Anytime you get a full hollow, it's going to be pretty good. Rollo is hitting the full hollow out of the break. Ho. And so, let's see. I don't see any of the symbols here either on this particular one. So maybe just in Nightfall, that was something about uh, Nightfall. Yeah, that's right. Okay, you guys. So this is actually uh, not a Nightfall first edition. So I, I, was say, I was talking about the Nightfalls. Sometimes if you find, if you find, all the time, if you find the four different symbols in that kind of meta zoo it's a more rare hit but that's not the case in this meta zoo this is um this is cryptid nation so that's why we're not seeing those those certain skull and certain designs So, anyway, that's a cool hit to have for Rallo. Congratulations. Yeah, that's exactly right.
Yeah, these are cryptonations, so they're different. Okay, so that's grounding here. Spirit Aura. So congratulations, Robert S. With ground. Wait, that says grounding. Maybe maybe there's another one that's just ground. Let me check and see. There is, and it's Rollo's. So my apologies there. I thought I was awarding that to Robert S. for a minute, but that's a different card. Grounding, and Rollo has ground. So that goes to Rollo. You guys, I'm going to put the NFL battle cards into pack rips so we can at least get to see those. And then maybe we'll start doing some boxes. We'll see what we think of these. Let's, I hope somebody gets some packs of those battle cards of NFL so we can just check them out. Um, so anyway, here we go with the last card out of the break. It's Spirit Aura. And that goes to Rallo. So uh, congratulations with the Mothman in there, Robert S. And we have the Hollow, which those are the two big ones out of the break. The Hollow went to Rallo. And now we have the coin random. And um, let's start that one up. So, uh, bum, 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 bum. Seven times three winners on the top list for the coin. It's more like a token. Um, it's a token. Oh, geez. Great. Just great. So I'm playing fantasy football, and I need the kicker for the Redskins to perform well, get three or four field goals. Three, three field goals would, would do it or would have done it, I guess. There we go. But now he's hurt. The kicker's hurt. So anyway, these battle cards are really cool. There's the token uh, right there. Let's go ahead. It's Cryptid Nation all over it. Cryptid Nation. Let's see who gets that. And uh, boom, boom, boom. Winners at the top of the set for seven. We're going to look at the NFL battle cards in a second. And maybe we can find some on eBay that have some big values. So we really know what we're looking for. But... It's actually kind of easy with those to see what we're looking for. Seven times through. Lucky number seven. Robert S., this is your coin. Congratulations. Hope. 
So you got the cryptid coin, bro. Nice going with your token. And so that is a nice break there uh, in that blister pack. If you want to do another one of those, it's only $7.99 to get into it. That's a lot of fun. Pretty cool stuff popping out.